I know, it's easy to jump on the bandwagon on horrific school shootings, but they are horrific school shootings. I know people have gone on TV and said we have fewer school shootings than we had in the 90s. You know what? I don't care. One student who shot in a public school is one too many students. I'm a parent. I had two students in schools. Your parents, you have students in school. You had students in schools. This should not happen anymore in the country. Full stop. Now, we can argue about guns. I'm all for sensible gun laws. I mean, I don't think we should have weapons of war in the hands of the wrong people. We've already agreed in this country that we shouldn't be able to buy a machine gun at Walmart. That's right, people. The government does tell you what to do with guns. You can't buy a machine gun at Walmart. It's been that way since about 1934. If you want to get a machine gun, you've got to go through all kinds of hoops and go through constant FBI checks and the rest. The point of it is there is regulation, and we should think about sensible gun laws. But beyond that, Let's just secure the public schools, shall we, in all schools, for that matter, because if you go into a federal courthouse, federal office building, a state office building, you can't take a gun in there. I know we have signs that say you can't take guns in private businesses, but people still do take guns in there when they're nuts. But you can't physically take a gun in the federal courthouse. You just can't do it. Why don't we secure our schools in the same way, with limited doors or with security, with dogs, Armed guards, I don't care what you do. You have some sort of a system as a backup with guns in the central office. If somebody's authorized to use it in the school and certified 10 times over, I'm open to anything. Because the argument that if you have guns in schools, more people will die. Well, guess what? The cops at the congressional baseball practice a year ago, two cops with handguns took down that shooter with a very powerful long gun. It can be done, unlike in Florida when the four cops stayed outside the building. They had handguns, too, but they didn't go into the building to stop the shooter. Hey, this has to stop. Full stop. No more. It can't happen again. And the country should demand that because these are our children. If we care more about security in a federal building than we do about security of our children in schools, then shame on us. My two minutes, my two cents are brought to you by... Capital Consultants and Edge Construction. Mike Tuig and his staff can redo your kitchen, your basement, your bathroom, your staircase. Make your home feel just like home. We can argue about this more next time on Two Minutes with Mitch.